Blue Jays fans, we beat the Tampa Bay Rays in a three game series. The Toronto Blue Jays, that's right, they do their job, they do their justice, and they beat the Tampa Bay Rays. They finish them off. What an absolute gorgeous way to close out the series. And I'm so happy. As you probably just saw, I just posted my video from yesterday. And I decided instead of making a double video, I'll just post that one and then make this one. So, without further ado, we got a game to recap. The Jays win 6-3 at home at the Rogers Center against the Tampa Bay Rays. And we start in the bottom of the first. Bo Bichette with two men on. Homers to left on a 1-2 count. Marcus Simeon scores on the play. Garo Jr. scores on the play. A three-run shot by Bo Bichette, and it is quickly 3-0, but bottom of the third, runners on third base and first. Our runners on third and second, my apologies. Bo Bichette gets up to the plate, hits a sack fly, that'll score in Marcus Simeon. All runs converted today so far by Bo Bichette. He is having a masterclass game for the Jays. Top of the fifth, Mike Zanino. Homers to left on a full count. That'll cut the deficit a little bit. It's 3-1 to one now. Instead, bottom of the fifth, Bo Bichette hits an infield single. Another run scored in by Bo Bichette. He's got five ribbies on the day. And then continuing to Oscar Hernandez. Singles to center. Guerrero Jr. scores on the play. It is to 6-1. In which case, the top of the eighth, the Rays will close the gap just a little bit. Phillips, homers to center on a full count. Walls will score on the play. The eight and nine hit are getting a homer. Yikes, that scared me just a bit. Luckily, Jordan Romano came in and saved the day. Robbie Ray would get the win today. 12 wins in the season, five losses, seven innings pitch, one run, and 13 strikeouts by Mr. Robbie Ray. He, he played perfection. He was unbelievable. And Michael Walker, who is now 3-5 on the season with 6 innings pitched, 2 base on balls, and 5 strikeouts and 6 earned runs by Michael Walker. Not really a great performance by him. So, like I said, we beat the... Or sorry, we beat the Tampa Bay Rays. I was going to say the Boston Red Sox. Boston Red Sox and the New York Yankees are now tied with us again of course all the teams won the yankees beat the orioles the boston red sox destroyed the seattle mariners late in the game and the jays obviously beat the Tampa bay race so we go on to a very important series now against the minnesota twins where we got to make up some ground and this is going to be a very important series for the jays to possibly sweep we know in the minnesota twins they have some pretty good pitching so it may not be a sweep michael pineda is going to be the man for Minnesota Twins. He is 6-8 on the season with a 387 ERA. Very respectable for a team who is not ver doing very well this season. So he has a very good ERA in that regard. Henny Ryu, on the other hand, has 13 wins. The most wins for the Blue Jays on the season with 8 losses. But somehow has a 411 ERA. Henny Ryu, he's having a tough season even though he has the most wins. Doesn't matter. The put they're putting the amount of appearances where they're hitting... The ball pretty far and it's just working for him you you know he gets lit up sometimes but the jays they come back and they steal the run so it, it goes hand in hand we're gonna have to see exactly what the jays can do against michael pineda in the start of this series but the jays will get one day of rest before they head into this game so blue jays fans if you're watching baseball today you're watching that baltimore game and new york yankees game like a hawk you're hoping the Baltimore Orioles can pull out a win for us. And, you know, maybe maybe it happens. Maybe it doesn't. Maybe the Yankees will go half a game ahead of us going into that Twins game. Put a little bit more pressure on us. But they got a tough Cleveland series coming. And the Red Sox, they're going to go play Baltimore. So, this is, some ground, this is a chance to make some ground on the Yankees for both teams. The Boston Red Sox and the Blue Jays. It's going to be interesting how it works out. But ladies and gentlemen, that is a lot today for today. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to hit that like button. Subscribe for more of these videos. And please make sure to turn on your post notifications to get notified when these videos do come out. One more thing, please, please, please make sure 
to share this video with your friends and family. It helps me out a lot, guys, and I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Take it easy, guys.